up at the sausage fest. Oh yes, the girls are remorse, so I hide in my hood like I'm joining a cult. Uh -huh. I'm as nervous as my cat, old dirty Curtis. All my writings are written and all my verses are purchased. Me, I'm never dating actress. Got too many back sits. Plus, my whole home aroma is cat piss. Every show I do is poorly promoted, and if you like this, it's because my little sister wrote it. I'm awesome. No, you're not, dude. Don't lie. I'm awesome. Driving around in my mom's ride. I'm awesome. A quarter of my life gone by, and I met all my friends online. Motherfucker, I'm awesome. I will run away from a brawl. I'm awesome. There's no voicemail, nobody calls. I'm awesome. I can't afford to buy eight balls, and I talk to myself <laughs> on Facebook wall. I'm awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so perfect. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I should talk to you since uh, I'm outside, right? <laughs> yeah, that little clip uh, before, I posted it on Facebook as well. Well, my personal Facebook for my dad and stuff, because he says he has a hard time watching uh, YouTube videos on his computer if something happens, whatever. Maybe watching th uh, YouTube through Facebook, while on Facebook, you know what I mean? Maybe that might be the mess up. Maybe it might be YouTube. It's I'm, I'm not in front of his computer. I can't tell you. But yeah, I'm on my way to a store. It looks like dust over there. Oh my god, is that jackhammer noise coming from over there? Ah, oh, Jesus. Freaking hell. <sighs> Doing some oh, wind, wind. Hold on, let me cross the street. Whew, walking through a cloud of dust, dirt, dust, whatever. Yeah, so uh, I'm on my way to a store for uh, supplies for um, the day 100 video. I don't know. I mean, see, the thing is, I want to do something like a, a little skit type thing, but. I want to, I'm not sure if I'm going to do a vlog portion, or I might vlog what I'm doing, or use the outtakes as a vlog, but one or the other. Ooh. It's going to be awesome if I can pull it off. If I get somebody to work the camera, that's the major point about it. Man, I can't do it alone because, I mean... It would require me to be a far distance away from my tripod and I don't want to risk somebody jacking my cra camera and shit, so... I don't know. I, however, am going into the store anyways, getting some supplies. <sighs> and what kind of store is it? The Halloween store. <laughs> And white makeup. Just zombie shit. It's got like gashes and stuff, spirit gum, spirit gum remover, some sponges to do makeup with, some makeups, but those aren't exactly colors that I want. I need white also, so I got a thing of white. And yep, that's what I got at the store. Zombie esque. You know, just put a couple gashes in, you know, it's white makeup and stuff, and I'm like, Ugh. I mean, I'm already brain dead anyway, so uh, it's pretty easy for me. Uh, I figure I'll answer the door like that and stuff, but, um, I hope those are reusable. And you just get some of the spirit gum off of it, and you can reuse the things. You should be able to reuse them. They shouldn't tear when you go to take them off if you're using the remover properly. So, yeah. But, I definitely want to make a video with them. I'm not sure. You see, I have this hope, this desire to make a zombie video of, um, something that's cool and um you know like a zombie parody of it whatever but the thing is I'm not as good in front of the camera as I am behind the camera you know and I need somebody who would like to dress up as a zombie and do stuff 
and be filmed. But um, I don't know. It's just <sighs> and you know, I just <sighs> either way though on Halloween itself because it will be day 100. I will be wearing that and I'll be answering the door, you know, trick-or-treaters and stuff like that and I'll be throwing them candy, whatever. But I'll be wearing that the entire length for that day. But um, yeah, so yeah, is today done? Am I done with today? Film-wise, you know, clip-wise, video-wise, um, oh, the, uh, debates last night. <laughs> oh, man, dude, Sandeep, per, uh, I can't say his name, from the Guild, with Felicia Day and stuff, he tweeted something about, you know, starting a, getting a Kickstarter going for bandits and horses, you know, for the apocalypse and everything, of course, you know, making fun of Obama and Romney and stuff and um, so I made a picture of Romney holding a bayonet with a horse kicking up in the background and um, tweeted it to him saying here's a picture for your Kickstarter he retweeted it he's like 50 bucks gets you American flag spurs <laughs> it was awesome um, yeah but any hoozles I watched the after show, the post show, uh, Philly D and uh, PDS Live and everything and with Gary Johnson on there and I gotta say, I mean, Gary Johnson seems cool and all and I like a lot of what he has to say but a lot of what he had to say seemed a little bit in unrealistic to me. Like sure, a lot of the things he said would sound good in theory but it does not sound realistic or reachable at least not in two terms like let's say we voted him in and he got voted in for a second term I, all the things that he said he wanted to do does not seem that he could even get halfway through that stuff in eight years you know so i'm giving him the benefit of doubt and seeing a full eight years i just don't think he can get half of the stuff that he says he wants done done i just don't think that he's the person to do it i You know, a, a lot of the time when he was talking and stuff, it seems like he was just kind of dead. Like, in his eyes were just kind of dead. Like, he was talking and he seemed expressive, but his eyes just showed no emotion. They were just blank. And that scares me, you know? Like, you should be able to convey emotion through your eyes as well. Not just the rest of your face, but you should be able to convey it with your eyes as well, you know? And just, I don't know, I I like him, but I don't think that he's the candidate for me. I'm going to have to stay with Obama. Um, the progress Obama has made is progress. It may not be ideal, and it may not be where he said he wanted to be in the beginning of his first term, but... It's still progress. It's not regress. He hasn't taken us backwards. You know, we are moving forwards. And I feel if Romney gets elected, we're going to be going in a backwards direction. I feel that Romney is too much of a flip flop. He keeps saying one thing, then he says another thing. Like he keeps changing his story during, throughout the debates. And then last night he kept saying he agrees with Obama, with what Obama keeps saying. I said, well, if he agrees so much, why is he running against him? Why? <laughs> it just... I don't know, man. I'm going to let you go. I'm going to go do my stuff. And um, don't forget, man. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Do something. Involve yourself in these videos. I... I mean, if you involve yourself in these videos, I will comment back in a response. It may not be right away, but it will be when I see them. And who knows? I, you may say something that sparks a conversation that I talk about in a video. You never know these things. They, it could happen. 
the world is a wondrous place. But, um, yes, please, please feel free. I am more than open. I'm a really nice, friendly person. I mean, I even take criticism well. Uh, somebody criticized me on something. And I can't for the life of me remember what it was. And I was like, oh, well, thank you for watching my videos. <laughs> you know, just like, hey, cool. <laughs> it's all right. It's attention, you know. Bad attention is just as good as good intention. Good attention, you know. Attention is attention when it comes to these videos, man. You know, whatever, whatever gets you out there, whatever gets you noticed, whatever gets people talking about you, you know, they, they do, it really is true, there is kind of no such thing as bad publicity unless you punch a baby. Uh, that would probably be bad publicity there, yeah. We're the bad PR. Don't punch babies, man. That's not cool. Peace.